just took a shower and then I did my skincare routine and then I got dressed. I'm just wearing like a casual outfit because I think most of the morning slash afternoon I'm going to be in the house um, doing things here. So I don't think it's really important for me to put a whole outfit on. The first thing I wanted to do is make my bed and make some breakfast. Let's do that. just finished breakfast it was very very yummy oh and if you're wondering why I'm sitting on the floor it's because I live in a studio so I don't really have enough space for a dining table so I pretty much eat all of my meals on my coffee table I think I might start by doing some homework I think I have to do some readings and um, like a one page written assignment which shouldn't take me too too long but hopefully I can get that done relatively quickly because I don't want to be doing homework all day and then once I'm done with that I might start cleaning but I'm not really sure I just have like no motivation right now to clean my apartment it's not that messy but it definitely needs like everything needs to be put away like some dishes need to be washed and just like you know the little things that just accumulate over time but for now, I think I'll just start with my homework and then we'll see where the day will take us. <laughs> I just finished my homework and I was just thinking, I kind of wanted to explain like my schooling situation and what I'm doing right now. Um, and with the pandemic and stuff, not to bring that up so soon, but it really affected my college experience. I went to school for one year and then at the end or like spring of my first year of college was when the pandemic hit. So I got to live in dorms. I got to experience that whole life for almost a year. And then COVID happened and it really just took me out of the mindset of wanting to focus on my education and stuff like that so I ended up transferring schools and so much stuff happened in my life I moved out of my parents house and moved out on my own like into a real apartment and I went through a few roommates and just life experiences and learned a ton and now all of a sudden I'm 21 and living on my own completely so things just happen really quickly it feels like it's only been like six months but it's really been like years at this point two years or longer now i'm studying to be a child youth and family studies major which to be honest like i kind of feel lost in my degree like i don't really know if it's exactly what I want, but it's too late almost to change my mind. But now is a good chance to just flip that. Maybe this term I can like try to focus on being more positive about school and I don't even know, trying to like get the best out of my education. Cause if I'm paying for it, I might as well um, enjoy what I'm doing. It's been really, it's been really difficult to be honest. I haven't been feeling very studious like I have not been feeling like I even go to school let alone that I'm fully in college and so it's just hard but yeah I wanted to just kind of talk about my experience so far 
I don't really know how much longer I have in school because I'm going part-time. That's another thing that changed with the pandemic is I had to start working full-time and going to school part-time. So it's been taking me a lot longer, but I have to remind myself that it is still okay. And on average, it takes people, I think I heard that it takes people like six years on average to get their undergrad in America. But that might be just something that I tell myself <laughs> to make myself feel better. But but I, I know I can do it. It's just, it's overwhelming. Um, and I'm sure there's a lot of people that feel the same way that I do. Okay, so I'm on my way to the grocery store now. And I just have my weekly groceries to get nothing special. But I think I'm going to get a few things for my house. I need some new pillows. Because last night I was sleeping and I realized that my pillows are like two years old and there's like an indent where my head goes and I, it was just not comfortable so I feel like I might try to get some new pillows. Another thing is it's October. It's actually like the middle of October and it's 80 degrees outside right now and I live in Oregon so like the weather is never like this. Um, yeah. I don't really know what's going on this fall, but hopefully soon we can have some real fall weather. I really want to be able to start bundling up and just enjoying like cold weather. So I don't know, hopefully that will happen soon. Okay, so I just got back from the grocery store. And just to clear some stuff up, I know you saw in the last clip that I have this Hobby Lobby reusable bag. I do not shop at Hobby Lobby, I've never been there. This reusable bag is so nice because it's like literally gigantic and can hold like all of my groceries in one bag. So it's like easy for me to take up because I live on the top floor of my building. So it helps with the transportation. But I'm gonna do a grocery haul. I didn't get a ton of stuff, but I still figure you guys would want to see what I got. Got some chips. You know, I've been trying really hard to get better at getting myself snack food because for a long time, I just stopped getting snacks because I, I told myself that it would mean that I wouldn't like eat them and I'd be a little bit healthier. But in reality, it's just honestly annoying because then I'll get hungry for snacks and I don't have any so I'm trying to get better at that okay so to start off with the non-edible things I picked myself up a candle lighter because I don't have one I just have regular lighters and I've been noticing that I've been needing that so not much to that I got myself a new can opener my old one was getting like rusty did not know that they did that and then everything else is edible so tonight or one of the nights this week I'm gonna be making meatball sub so I got some meatballs marinara sauce and some fresh rolls and I figured that that was gonna be a really nice easy meal to make I also got some frozen orange chicken. This is such an easy meal and I just make it with rice and like add some green onions, which I got and some avocados just sliced up. And then I usually will make like a spicy mayo sauce or something. Um, I got these vegan corn dogs to try. I like the Morningstar brand. I've just never tried the corn dogs. I don't really even like corn dogs that much. So I don't remember why I got that. I got some outshine. Um, more snacks these bunnies that looked really good it just reminds me of like those little teddy grams that I used to have when I was a little kid I got chocolate chips I got two bags because I wanted to stock up and I also think I'm going to be making cookies this weekend I don't know if I want to make them today I kind of want them sooner than later but I don't know and then to go with that I got baking powder because I need that I got like a salad cake and some fruit some peaches some eggs everything else is pretty boring um but yeah that's those are my groceries it was a small haul today
So another thing that I got at the store, like I said, I was gonna get some new pillows. And I picked these up, like bamboo memory foam. To be honest with you, I have no idea how to buy pillows. I like touched all of them and they all felt uncomfortable. So I don't know if these are even gonna be comfy. They were like on sale for like $15. So because they were a little bit more expensive, I kind of figured that they would be better quality, but we're gonna see tonight when I sleep. But hopefully it's a better improvement than my two-year-old flat pillows that I have right now. But yeah, I'm gonna do that right now. Okay, so I just tested the pillows and they seem really great. I'm hoping that that helps me sleep a little bit better than I have been recently. I am going to make myself some lunch now and probably just watch some TV. I really don't have anything else to do the rest of the day except clean a little bit. My apartment's not that messy, so it's not really like make or break if I get that done today. I think I wanna do some reading later. I've been trying really hard to start reading and doing other activities besides just watching TV or being on my phone. It's been helping a little bit, but I still have like such a need to watch TV and like, I don't know, we're all like addicted to screens. So I know you can relate, but like I have been trying to make that more of a priority in my life. So I'm just gonna check in later, maybe after lunch and I'll, let you know what I'm doing for the rest of the day. So I just got done making dinner. I ended up making the meatball subs that I talked about earlier and they turned out really good. I didn't do a special recipe. All I did was the meatballs according to their like cooking direction. So I had to cook them in the oven. And then I sliced up my French rolls and put a little bit of marinara sauce on the bottom of them. Put the meatballs on top, put some more marinara sauce on top and then mozzarella cheese. And then I just like melted that in the oven and it turned out really, Good and it was so easy it took maybe 20 minutes since I last checked in I was doing some editing and just working on this vlog and then I ended up reading some of my book I'm gonna end the vlog here I have a little bit more editing to do for this vlog so I'm gonna get that done and then I'm gonna just have a chill night <laughs> 